Now, Megan the Stallion appeared to accuse her ex-boyfriend, Partisan Fontaine, of cheating. Specifically, like, cheating in the same bed that she slept in. So everyone was just really, really, you know, had something to say about that whole situation. But now he's firing back with his own song. Uh, it's called The Person. And he was very, very, very um, clear on what, how he felt. After watching people drag your name and, and, and talk about you in unfavorable ways in order to get attention or uh, clicks, I never thought you would do something like that to me. Uh, I, I'd like to apologize for uh, no longer keeping up with your lies or supporting your habits to tell half-truths. I hope this message reaches you well. I hope you get the help you need. Look, you talk shit about Kellen, this shit about Jayla and Darren. Talk shit about everybody set for the person in the mirror that's staring. You talk this shit like you key shit and cry like a Karen. Those the words that you want, money you got, clothes that you wear. A whole lot happened in this last two years, but this is the part that you sharing. I just wish you tell the whole truth. When you was going through shit, oh, I hold you. It's gonna be okay, is what I told you. I was the real you can sit as close to. And that's real. The people that know you don't love you. The people that love you don't know you. I loved you out loud, I was vocal. Said you never seen it up close. I said, come here, baby, let me show you. Sit down for a second, girl, you need to hear this. Be for real, you ain't even realistic. Got light pole, then you started posting gym pics. The things that you're doing is sadistic. Spend four hours doing glam, not a blemish. But your foundation is off, you need to fix it. Clean up your spirit. And not just your image. I thought that's what you was doing with your downtime. When a snake shed his skin, it only changed on the outside. You got emotional hurdles. Man, the work that you need is internal. When love goes bad, can't believe it. Archive pics, so you can't delete it. Damn, see me with Jay the Kingdom, and then you went Jay the Pinky. Saw you pop out, wished you the best. You see me pop out, start gripping your chest. Damn, thought you was on an island healing. I guess the new album need a villain. Brand new way for you to be a victim. And you did all of this on my daughter's birthday. Ooh, girl, you consistent. Ish, shit, I gotta love you from a distance. Same shit again, you did all the tags for the beats. You let that nigga tag, let them beat. Oh, you let me give them that when we meet. Even that. Yo, man. Yo. Oof. Partisan telling his truth. I mean, you know, yeah. there's things, there's two things in the song I didn't really appreciate him for, which was talking about her lipo and then talking about how she talked about her friends. You know, because girls talk talk about their friends all the time and then they still friends. So that's yeah, and the, and the lipo girl. part probably wasn't needed either. I mean, Every, the lipo part was kind of kind of clean though. Because he wasn't. What he, what he said was, you got lipo, then you got on, started doing workout. Because she really got on her workout thing like. That kind of annoys me, man. People get light and then go no, no, on, no. on online and make it seem like you're wait, saying, wait, no, those are two different you're things. Two different things. No, yeah, that's I, what he said, though. Right, but we agree with you that that idea is annoying. It's airing someone out for the private. Like that just feels a little icky to me. Well, only oh. because that doesn't have anything to do with no. It's set, but it sets it sets a precedent like of of not telling the truth. Listen, let me just be clear. That just sounds like you're talking about girl talk. The Ooh. other things, the other things about it, the other things about the song, I feel is super valid. Like, for first of all, he was, for people out there, it's like, oh, now he got to say something. He was an artist before he got with her and had mad accolades in helping other artists, Cardi B included, write right, records right, before he got right, with her. Right, right, right. So he's he's a, he's had a, a profile. He's a, he's a really good rapper and writer, by the way. Right. Re he, I mean, I'm a fan. Well, I'm, but for yes. people who didn't know him and are saying he's just jumping out now because it's a convo, he already had a profile. Maybe it wasn't as big as it was when he got with Megan, but he already had a profile, so he's going to come out and say something. Right. The other parts of the song, though, I think is is super valid. Um, but party, here's the problem: for him, it doesn't just because she's a bad person and the person you decided that you wanted to spend your time with. It doesn't excuse the fact that her claim is that you cheated, even though in your mind maybe y'all wasn't together, which is what the song sounds like he's saying. Yeah, and then it's a lot like um, he he calls her out for like leaving for a while and he thought it was over and then you know there was pictures of her with some soccer player that's right at a wedding i don't know it's messy the most but valid thing party said was to me out of all of it nobody was even pressing the fact that they had broken up she brought that back to the forefront in her most recent record cobra yeah so yeah. 
she made this a thing, their breakup, more than he did. That's super valid for then him to come respond. Right, because it was like, because people were wondering, like, why they broke up. Because they, you know, he stood by her through the people whole People break trial. up every day, B. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll do, I just, I just, end, in, in this song at the end, though, he says, this isn't for Megan the Stallion. He's like, this is for Megan the person. So he also was very direct. Like, it wasn't, you know what I mean? Well, he wasn't he, like, he was very he was direct. In circles. He, was, he was very direct. He was very, also very direct that she lied to him about having sex with Tory Lanez and she lied to him about other people that she had had sex with because he said, I straight up asked you about this and then had to find out with the world yeah. during the court trial. Yo, I, I have two yeah. things to say about this. Number one, the Keisha Karen bar is flames. <laughs> you know uh, that that bar is flamed and Ebro number two I, I, I'm gonna do it I'm going out on a limb if you this song right here if you're Megan this song in its entirety not a great optic this is not a great oh you're going out on a limb that this is a bad look it's <laughs> not a the stuff that's said in there is not a great look I'm just being honest with you <laughs>